next is to set up hate speech courts to deal with hate mongers ahead of the August general elections. Chief Justice Martha Kome also said that 120 court officers will soon be gazetted to deal with electoral offenses. And as Chemutai Goy now reports, DPP Nudin Haj has put on notice electoral offenders, saying no one will be spared the wrath of the law. As the race to the August polls gains momentum, preparations for the general elections are in top gear. For IEBC, the pressure to deliver a free, fair and credible election is on. Today, players in the criminal justice system converge to launch guidelines set to facilitate electoral justice. Chief Justice Martha Colm is saying plans were underway to train new court officers following the gazetting of 120 new court stations dedicated to electoral offences. When a prosecutor is empowered, knowing all the groups in the electoral law, it doesn't make sense if they are appearing before a magistrate. Who, is, who has no clue on what is a Kim's kit or what is an electoral offence. So we must move in tandem. At the ODPP, we are committed to ensuring that the perpetrators of electoral offences are prosecuted and punished to the full extent of the law. On the radar too, were leaders propagating hate speech. Also working on a plan of operationalising hate speech courts in the hot uh, spot areas uh, to ensure that they are ready all the time uh, to hear these matters. We need timely and accurate investigations, effective prosecution with ample evidence and an expedited trial process to show our nation that we can, that indeed we are serious about adding these crimes. We are extremely anxious about the capacity of the judiciary to handle the election petitions that are coming in light of the acute shortage of judges. IEBC Chairman Wafula Chabukati expressing confidence that this year they were better prepared than the previous election. He have a warned pre-election offenders of risking being barred from participating in the election. We find the issues are mainly around violence, uh, they, they, they go to uh, matters of hate speech and also usage of uh, uh, state resources. These are some of the matters that uh, will uh, come up as we go along. On our part as the Communication Authority, we are committed to facilitating the IEBC on the issue of network coverage for results transmission. On the cybersecurity component, the CEO continues to work with other law enforcement agencies to monitor and support law enforcement activities around elections. And today, the Paul's body IEBC received a shot in the arm after Treasury allocated an additional 8.81 billion shillings for the preparation of the August election. <laughs> and police were also allocated an additional 950 million shillings aimed at recruiting additional officers to boost security during the polls. The deliberations come as police intensify investigations into the stoning of Raila Odinga's chopper last Friday. With the men's partisan interests already being displayed ahead of the August 9th election, players in the justice sector put their heads together to identify challenges impeding the election and come up with solutions to ensure that post-August 9th, the disputes are minimized. Chamutai Goin, Citizen TV, Kenya School of Government, Nairobi.